here's the cardboard template. Next, grab it on with this piece of wood and cut the angles. Well, I repeated that process and I made three dividers for the overhead compartment. Now those three sections are going to mount to this backing board, which I already notched out to hold the three pieces. Okay, next I'm going to get rid of these sharp corners and I'll put a radius on them. On the top and the bottom of the shelf, I'm using uh, half inch dowels for some. Now I have a half inch hole, top and bottom of the back for support. Next, I'm going to be drilling small holes on the edge for the shot cord. Okay, this is the unit all screwed and glued up. Okay, next I'm going to give it a coat of polyurethane and then we'll uh, strain the shock cord. Well, the next step on the storage shelf, I'm going to take some of this bungee cord or shock cord and I'm going to string it through the shelf. Okay, the uh, shelf's installed. Take a look. Okay, we found a great way to keep our clothes in these packing cubes because it keeps them really neat. We can put them in our cabinets and Art just made some extra storage and we can Well, thanks again for watching the video today, and very shortly, we're leaving for a two-month road trip down south. And we'll be driving all the way down to Key West, and stay tuned for more travel videos. Yes, and if you liked the video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you don't want to miss any upcoming videos on YouTube. Also, we post on Facebook and Instagram. See you later. Bye-bye.